That's your Wake News traffic. Now it's time for the best video and sounds from overnight and this morning in our Wake News eye opener. There was an apparent gas explosion. We are now confirming two fatalities. There are 100 prison inmates and officers recovering. This after an overnight gas explosion at the Escambia County Jailhouse. Now this happened in the main booking area. This potentially could be related to weather. Uh, the spokesman on the scene here says that there was extensive weather related damage. They think as much as 22 inches of water, uh, as much as five inches in an hour and the water just came up so fast. Thousands of people in Pensacola are making their way through the streets in boats after the rainiest day ever recorded thanks to a severe and deadly storm system. Roads torn up, uh, water clear through home. One block can be just completely devastated in the next few houses over untouched. Powerful winds in Athens, Georgia pushed a tree onto a man's car, killing him. Take a look at this Baltimore road that collapsed because of a landslide. Today, Thomas Murray is expected in court for a first appearance. He's a Fort Myers man at the center of a 10-hour standoff. Murray faces charges of possession of a firearm by a convicted felon and resisting arrest. At the time, the winds were blowing in excess of 70 miles an hour. It made the fire very difficult to access. A thousand acres have already been scorched. Air attacks impossible. Price you pay for living in the uh, you know, near a wilderness area. Toronto Mayor Rob Ford will take a leave of absence to seek help for substance abuse. Ford will also take a break from his campaign. For the good of the city, I call on Mayor Ford to resign from his office as mayor. Yes, I have some more crack cocaine. Okay. To first base. Bauer, bad hop. Can they make the play? Yes! Dozier with a terrific play. Heisman Trophy winner Jameis Winston must complete at least 20 hours of community service. The requirement comes after Winston allegedly walked out of a Tallahassee grocery store without paying for $32 worth of crab legs and crawfish. Really? Really. And that's your Wink News This Morning Eye Opener.